DCFS does not care about the well-being of children. Take Harris' lack of concern for example. When Angelina's mother confided in Harris about the torment her daughter faced from bullying and cyberbullying at her middle school, Harris had no reaction. Listen. Actually, we have a meeting with, uh, with my daughter's school because she's been being bullied. Okay. Yes, and actually okay. she's been cyberbullied. So um, we have a meeting to go to tomorrow like okay. at 8.05. And then um, and after that, I guess uh, that's, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much what we're, we're doing right now. Mm -hmm. Okay, good, good. Well, listen, I did not close your referral because, you know, I have to consult with my supervisor and there were some concerns. In the delivered service log, Harris neglected to document Angelina's traumatic experience of being bullied and its adverse effects which is an essential element in assessing the child's needs and level of care. Angelina's mother informed Harris of a crucial meeting that was scheduled for the next morning. There they'll have the opportunity to discuss their concerns with the school principal, as well as the students involved and their parents. In preparation for this significant meeting, Angelina's mother remains steadfast in her support, choosing to stay home and help her daughter get ready to prove her case to the principal. Angelina's mother advised her daughter to take notes of everything her bullies would do to her during the day. Then later on she would help her type them up and print them out. The mother chose to stay with her daughter and she missed taking the drug test. This was much more important. So important that the mother had a great idea. Angelina was going to have her father, mother, brother, sister and grandfather all attend this school meeting. The mother felt the daughter would feel outnumbered by having to sit across from four of her bullies. The mother was always great that way, she always thought about her children. It would be the last time the family all stood together. 